draw a hot bath and spend some quality time with my thoughts. No, you can't watch. I'll leave the door cracked. Well, Horace, I can't believe I destroyed the town and hurt all those people. And all to find a guy who doesn't even exist. What the hell was I thinking? Holy crap, I knew it! Wait, 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 wait. I already paid for this. Let's do this. But don't hit me in the stomach for a while. You know, because of the beer. Stop it! Hey, stop it! You bastard! Hey, stop it! Oh, crap!
cockpit! I'm fine, Lois. In fact, I learned something today. You can't always trust your feelings. Especially after watching five straight days of Mr. Belvedere with no sleep, and while constantly getting hit in the head by a very coincidentally large number of objects. Well, I learned that the dog track is horse racing for poor people. And I learned that I've got to stop over-scheduling myself. I mean, look at this. Booked solid through next Thursday. You know, there's just one thing I don't get. I know I was out of my mind in every way, but I swear that Mr. Belvedere head floating up in the sky was real. Hey, there it is again! What the hell is that? Oh, you're a hoot, Mr. Belvedere. Okay, now here's my screech. <laughs> <laughs> 